is complete. Um, the Celsius really kicked in towards the end of the workout. So I actually extended my workout because I was not supposed to do all that cardio that I did towards the end. But yeah, it was, it was great. I'm feeling great. I'm about to go make my protein smoothie. And I'm trying to figure out what, if I'm gonna take um, my vitamin supplements. The reason I'm hesitant is because the last time I took it, I ended up feeling sick and I don't wanna feel sick because I have stuff to do. I have some projects in the works. Speaking of which, I gotta call my school. Let me call my school real quick. Hey y'all, so I am, my glasses look dirty right there. I am getting ready to go to a family friend. Um, Wait, so I know that, oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm about to go to a family friend. I'm supposed to be doing some work for her, possibly tutoring. Y'all, I have been avoiding tutoring for so long. I was supposed to do it in college. Um, when I was working on my degree, I was offered a position to tutor for uh, I forgot what they called it, but it was like the advanced class, the advanced writing class, because I did really well. Um, they wanted me to tutor for it, and it was a requirement for my major, so hold on. Y'all, it was so chilly earlier, and now it is warm, and I put this outfit on because I was like, oh, I get to wear a little cover-up, and I might not even need it because it's, it's I'm already sweating. And I didn't want to put my contacts in. I was going to wear my hair out because I thought it would be chilly no humidity or a, li a little bit less humidity but now I'm like this is gonna be wrapped around my waist anyways um yeah so come on so that's what we're about to do I'm about to go to her house pick her up and then we're gonna go to the center that she wants me to tour her in and we gonna see we gonna work out we gonna figure it out <laughs>
crazy and crusty AF but I don't even care right now if I'm being honest I don't even care that's how I'm feeling I don't like I don't know right now I am about to get ready what time is it I wish I could like be for real and tell y'all everything that I would like to tell y'all in the moment moment like I wish I could tell y'all everything that I'm going through and that I'm feeling but I feel like I have to I have to do things with intention and I know that I wish I could tell y'all everything that I want to tell y'all like I wish I could like be for real for real with y'all and share but a lot of things I want to say are super personal and it would make me it would put me in such a vulnerable position and I'm just not sure if I'm ready to be vulnerable yet <laughs> um, but today is another day where I'm just like feeling blah um, I did wake up I worked out I'm trying to keep on track with that I'm trying to hold myself my quarterly goal is to do at least three days every week but this week's goal is to do five um because then it will what will happen is i will make up for the days that i missed <laughs> um but yeah i just have not been feeling myself things are a little off my life is so confusing right now and i think i'm when i get home from this tutoring class that i'm gonna well this tutoring session that I'm gonna go do um, when I get home I'm going to try my best to reset journal light my candle play some music and just talk to God from my heart because I'm so I'm in a state where I have a lot of things going on I have a lot of things going on and I just want discernment and um, like I said, I I try my best to be honest, open, transparent, and vulnerable. But at the same time, um, being too vulnerable puts me in a weird position. So, yeah. Anyways, let me finish up. I have one more thing on my... Who the hell is this walking here? Who is this? Oh, I think this is Eddie's. So they're working on the back deck, and I think this is his son, the guy who's working on the deck. So that's why the dogs are going off. But yeah, I got one more thing that's on my work to-do list to complete. So I'm going to do that. Hey guys, so I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but I happen to be tutoring some kids it is hot as heck right now yeah i happen to be tutoring some kids i i say i was semi-volunteered because you know one of those situations like oh if i can help i will so um i did say i don't mind tutoring but my strongest subjects are literature english lucky lou um, you know, sorry, the dogs. And my strongest subjects are literature, um, English, and those of the sorts. Writing, right? I'm good at that. Um, my worst subject, or I should say, I won't say worst because your girl was an A plus student. We're entering Pothole City, y'all. So, just so y'all know. Um, your girl was an A plus student in statistics. So I can't tell, I can't say, oh, you know, I was worse off or I like, that's like my, Jesus. I'm trying to make this quick because I'm getting to a point. Um, basically, I did not mind Jesus. What I'm trying to say is, <laughs> I did not mind 
Uh, let me put it here, let me hold it here. I did not mind assisting. However, I thought I'd be assisting with things that I not only enjoy, but I'm actually really good at. Um, I was supposed to be tutoring for, I think I mentioned it earlier in the vlog, like for college, an extensive writing program, they wanted me to tutor students because I was that, like I excelled at that class. Um, however, I, I was ha I was a full-time student, full-time job, had a full-time full -time job at the time, had just moved into our building. Like, um, it just wasn't gonna pan out. But anyways, I'm getting back to what I'm trying to say. I thought this was gonna be like me giving back to the community, which it is, it still is. Um, and me helping out, you know, but it is not my area of expertise. It is math and I have not done this kind of math in well over 20 years. And I think when I did it 20 years ago, I wasn't that good at it. This is my alarm telling me I need to leave the house now. Um, yeah, so, so yeah, that is where I'm headed to now. I, I'm only doing it for the first four days. I, this is not something I can do. If I'm being honest, um, if I'm asked to come back and just assist, I'm gonna say honestly, the way I'm doing it isn't efficient. If, you know, I can monitor them at best or I could coach them as far as general coaching and life coaching, but I am, I can't, I can't teach them. I can't tutor them in this subject area. It's not efficient. So right now I'm just assisting with homework and research, you know, trying to understand the formulas and stuff like that. But I can't, I don't think I can do this every week. And it's four days a week after work. No, I'm good. I'm good. But yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm probably not going to check in with you guys until I am on my way back home. So yeah, talk to y'all later and wish me luck. Yo, that was weird. Um, not me. Not realizing that I haven't recorded anything all day because I, um, I, ooh, okay, let's adjust, adjust. Are we not adjusting? Are we, are we, are we not adjusting? Okay, what are going on, so Hold on, y'all. Why is it so washed out? It usually auto, but let's go ahead and do it like this. All right, so not me literally not realizing I haven't recorded every day. Yeah, anyways, um, I was packing my purse for the tutoring session that I have for the girls later and I realized my camera was still in my purse since yesterday, which means I have not recorded anything, so my bad. Um, but I am getting ready to head to the city so that I can finish my last day of assisting with this tutoring um, business. So yeah, I I am uh, I was grateful for the opportunity to meet the girls, but it's one of those situations where it's not my subject of expertise, first of all, um, and secondly, just like it needs to be. How should I put this? The girls need to do better and come with the... I'm trying to word this and I'm not trying to be rude. Let me, let me think of a way to word this. The students need to know where they need help. Like, I can't tell you what your weakness is because I am not your teacher. I am supposed to aid and assist with you trying to better yourself in that subject and I can't aid and assist if you don't know where you need the help in. So that's one of the issues. And then like I said, I am just not like a subject expert matter when it comes to this particular subject. Baby, if you were writing an essay, I got you. If you were, now that I my battery life is good, now my camera wants to adjust properly. Anyways, as I was trying to say because before, as I was trying to say before my battery died, um, basically like I can't help you if you can't help yourself and if it was an essay if it was you know reviewing you know girl 
it, if it was getting a better hang on grammar and stuff like that, I can, I can assist it. But when it comes to math, when it comes to math, not not my strongest subject so yeah anyways other than that what's been going on i had a very emotional day yesterday i'm not even gonna lie yesterday when i got home i had a very emotional night and then i picked myself back up this morning did my workout and i'm pushing through the day um after the session i do have to log on to a webinar um and then i might start I might start editing, so there's that. Other than that, not much going on. I think I mentioned to y'all that um, we have a game to go to on Friday, so that's exciting. That's something for me to look forward to. Um, tomorrow is the beginning of a brand new month, so I'll actually be, I don't think I ever showed you guys my goal tracker. Of course, I probably won't share in detail my goals, but I will um, share with you how I track my goals for the month um, and then how I track it for the well it's a monthly slash quarterly uh, tracker so you'll be able to see what I do and how I kind of like just have a, a task checklist if you will um, to make sure that I am trying my best to stay committed to the goals that I've made for the month to help me meet my quarterly goals so I feel like somebody just pulled up, but I can't see the vehicle. Anyways, with that being said, let me finish getting ready. Um, and then I will probably pick you guys up. I can't promise on the way because I really don't have anything else going on other than driving down there. Um, these are minor, so I'm not about to put them on camera. Um, unless we were like in a more public setting or it was a public event. Like I think in the future, what might happen is I might assist with like some coaching especially because these are girls who went to my high school or who are currently attending my my high school so um that would be a great opportunity it would be even better if i could get some of my other friends involved um to speak to some of these girls and inspire them and to keep them motivated and to let them know we got this but anyways i feel like i'm rambling now so i'm gonna check in with you guys hopefully later you know what it is it's whenever I take my lashes off because I'm so used to wearing them I feel like I look like a completely different person so that's really what it is it's the fact that I don't have my lashes on and I feel like I look crazy mm. anywho it is Monday workout for the day is complete thank goodness and I wouldn't feel like doing it I'm not even gonna front y'all I did not feel like doing that workout I was tired I won't say slightly hungover maybe a pinch um i did drink two-thirds of a bottle of wine last night by myself because everybody else was drinking whiskey and i wasn't about to drink whiskey so but yeah still got goals so and easter is right around the corner for those of you who don't know hold on let me let this adjust for those of you who don't know easter is like a big holiday weekend here in belize um typically what happens is on thursday so holy thursday most people are traveling to their vacation destination my family personally used to go to placencia all the time but this year i'm going to san pedro and yeah so it's motivation for me because i really the goal is for my birthday but i really want to be i want to look good i want to look good easter so yeah 
But let's go make this protein shake and get to work. I have so, so much work to do. Got my smoothie. Now it's back to work. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go make myself some breakfast. I skipped my morning break during work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna extend, I'm gonna add like an extra 10 minutes to my lunch. So I'm going to make my late breakfast, um, early lunch, and then I am going to chill for a little bit, let my food digest, and then get ready, um, figure out what I'm gonna do with my hair. <laughs> it's always an issue. And then, yeah, I get dressed and stuff. I don't think I'm going out for the day. If I do, I'm probably gonna go uh, get some veggies, some fruit, and probably get some stuff to make. Um, what was I gonna make? Like a chicken wrap. Yeah, I wanted to make a chicken wrap. So like grab some lettuce, grab some shredded cheese. I think I have bacon, I think I have chicken breasts. So yeah, then I will fry that all up and, well, fry the chicken breast and then make a wrap. I think I have tortillas, so we should be good. like my breakdown of how I got my numbers um, so I was like hey if I miss something you know let me know but right now based on and I went over the instructions for the reporting like am I pulling the report right am I pulling these numbers right and I think I'm right so we'll see what he says because maybe he has some you know a different insight I don't know either way um, he needs to tell me what to do to get this out to the client um, what else was I going to say? Um, yeah, but right now I'm headed to the city. I got to go pick up this paperwork 
and I am, dang. And then I'm going to come back and stop at the store, stop at the roadside market, get some fruit. Um, that probably means I should have probably picked up some cash. Damn. I might go to the bank. I might go to the bank. We'll see. We will see. But yeah, I am headed to the city. Like I said, I gotta go to my school and hopefully the paperwork is ready by the time I get there. Um, and then I'm gonna go, well, I'm gonna come back up. I'm debating on whether or not I'm stopping at a grocery store called Brody's just because I really need some weight and the ones at Marab were just ridiculously priced. Um, so I, I kind of want some like five pound to eight pound weights. Um, so I'm considering stopping there. But honestly, the way I feel, I just want to go where I have to go. When is this going to adjust? How are we not adjusting right now? That's odd. Anyways, let me go ahead and, especially since my camera's not automatically adjusting. Um, yeah. Especially since my camera's not automatically adjusting. Let me go ahead and check in with y'all when I'm in better lighting. Is our 
Find a signal to focus. That's our headquarters. That's our police station. That is our popo station. vlog up if I cannot put it up or make it go live tonight I'm gonna have it go live tomorrow by midday but I am tired anyways thank you guys so much for watching I appreciate all of your love and support and your patience because I know I've been here there and everywhere so thank you guys I will see you guys in the next vlog bye